The mina, also spelled mina is a bird of the starling family, Sternidae. This is a group of passerine birds which are native to southern Asia, especially India, Pakistan and Bangladesh. Several species have been introduced to areas like North America, Australia, South Africa, Fiji and New Zealand, especially the common mana which is often regarded as an invasive species. It is often known as Solarang and Takmang in Malay and Chinese respectively in Singapore, due to their high population there. Manas are not a natural group, instead, the term mana is used for any starling in the Indian subcontinent, regardless of their relationships. This range was colonized twice during the evolution of starlings. First by rather ancestral starlings related to the Colto and Aplinus lineages, and millions of years later by birds related to the common starling and bottled starlings ancestors. These two groups of manas could be distinguished in the more terrestrial adaptions of the latter, which usually also have less glossy plumage except on the heads and longer tails. The Bali mina which is nearly extinct in the wild is highly distinctive. Mina is derived from the Hindi language Maina, which itself is derived from Sanskrit Madana. Some manas are considered talking birds, for their ability to reproduce sounds, including human speech, when in captivity. Manas are medium-sized passerines with strong feet. Their flight is strong and direct, and they are gregarious. Their preferred habitat is fairly open country, and they eat insects and fruit. Plumage is typically dark, often brown, although some species have yellow head ornaments. Most species nest in holes. Some species have become well known for their imitative skills, the common hill mina is one of these. Scientific classification of mina, kingdom, animalia, phylum, cordata, class, aves, order, passary forms, family, sternity. The following are species of minas. The colto and the two surreal glossa starlings are included because of their position in the taxonomic list. The yellow-faced mina, Minodumatii, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is found in New Guinea and nearby smaller islands, where its natural habitat is subtropical or tropical moist lowland forests. It grows to a length of between 23 and 26 centimeters, 9 and 10 inches, and is one of the largest species of starling. The head has short black feathers glossed bluish purple on the forehead and at the base of the upper mandible, but most of the head is bare yellowish orange skin. This forms a wide patch around and behind the eye and includes a bib on the chin and the sides of the throat. The neck, central throat and mantle are black glossed with purple while the back, wings, Breast and belly are black gloss with green. The rump is white, the lower belly is golden yellow and the undertail covers are white. The short, squarish tail is black. The iris is usually yellow, but in some parts of New Guinea may be brown. The bill and legs are yellow. The Golden Mina Minoanias is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is found in New Guinea. 
its natural habitat is subtropical or tropical moist lowland forest. It grows to a length of 25 centimeters, mean 152 grams. Medium sized, distinctively patterned mina with patch of bare circumorbital skin extending to form a blue wedge behind eye. Nomine trace has head. The long tailed mina, Mino crafty, is a member of the starling family. It is resident in the Bismarck Archipelago and northern Solomon Islands. It resembles the yellow-faced mina, and the two were formerly considered conspecific. Going on standard measurements and length, this very large mina is one of the largest member of the diverse family Sternidae, behind only perhaps the Nias Hill mina. It measures 29 to 32 centimeters, 11 to 13 inches, in length. Among standard measurements, the wing cord is 15.4 to 16.8 centimeters, 6.1 to 6.6 inches, the tail is 11.2 to 12.1 centimeters, 4.4 to 4.8 inches. The culmin is 2.9 to 3.3 centimeters, 1.1 to 1.3 inches, and the tarsus is 3.8 to 4.3 centimeters, 1.5 to 1.7 inches. No known weights have been reported. These measurements are just slightly larger on average than the closely related yellow-faced mina and indicate the species is around three times as massive as the common starling. The long-tailed mina mainly has purple glossed black plumage dot it has bright orange-yellow patches of naked skin around each eye. It has a yellow lower belly and white wing patches which are obvious in flight. The rump and undertail are white and the strong bill is bright yellow. The long-tailed mina nests in tree holes, often in palms. The eggs are pale blue with delicate reddish or grey markings. This mina is arboreal, and is found alone or in pairs in open lowland forests and plantations. It feeds mainly on fruits and berries. It is a conspicuous and vocal species with a wide range of whistles and squawks. The Sulawesi mina, Basilorna celibansis, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is endemic to Sulawesi, Indonesia. Its natural habitat is subtropical or tropical moist lowland forests. The Sulawesi mina grows to a length of 23 to 27 centimeters, 9.1 to 10.6 inches. It is a glossy black bird with a permanently raised crest which is larger and a male. The sides of the face and throat have white patches. The eye is surrounded by a bluish black ring of bare skin, the beak is pale bluish green and the legs are yellowish. Juvenile birds are chocolate brown. This mana has a range of sounds including grunts, high-pitched whistles, squeaks and warbles. One call is a descending sequence of whistles and another is a descending nasal call that sounds like meow and is uttered with the head thrusting forwards and the back feathers fluffed up. The species usually feeds high in the forest canopy. It usually occurs in pairs or small family groups, but sometimes solitary individuals can be seen. Immature individuals may join flocks of fiery proud starling, in Odzerithrophris, and it often associates with groups of other fruit-eating birds. 
Little is known about the breeding habits of this bird. Its diet is estimated to consist of about 44% fruit and 52% invertebrates, the balance being taken up by small vertebrates. It is a non-migratory species but, presumably moves about the forest in response to the ripening of fruits on different species of tree. The Helmeted Mina, Basilornis scalitus, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is endemic to Indonesia. The helmeted mina grows to a length of 23 to 27 centimeters, 9.1 to 10.6 inches. It is black with white spots on its face with the significant helmet-like crest. Its natural habitats are subtropical or tropical moist lowland forest, subtropical or tropical moist montane forest, and swamps. It is threatened by habitat loss. The long-crested mina, Basilornis cortex, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is endemic to Saram Island. Its natural habitats are subtropical or tropical moist lowland forest and subtropical or tropical moist montane forest. The long crested mina grows to 25 centimeters, 121 to 132 grams. Distinctive mina, with feathers of crown and nape directed towards midline, and elongated to form tail crest of degenerate plumes, tail wedge shaped. Calls include nasal notes interspersed with short piping notes series of five loud whistle. The Apolmina, Basilornis Mrandis, is a species of starling in the starling family Sternidae. The species is also known as the Mountipo starling or the Mountipo king starling. The specific name is Latin for wonderful or strange. It is endemic to Mindanao in the South Philippines. Its natural habitat tropical moist montane forests above 1,250 meters, 4,100 feet. It is assumed that the species is non-migratory. The Apolmina is a long-tailed starling, 30 centimeters, 12 inches, long and weighing around 110 grams. 3.9 ounces. The plumage is mostly glossy black, except for the lower back which is white. The feathers on the head are degenerate and form a floppy crest. There is a large patch of bare yellow skin around the eye and on the cheek creating a distinctive mask. The bill and legs are yellowish. Both the sexes are alike. Juvenile birds resemble adults but have less glossy plumage and have a buff edge to the feathers. Little is known about the behavior of this species. It eats berries and insects, and forages singly, as pairs or in small groups. Two nests have been found for this species, both in the holes excavated by woodpeckers into trees. One of those nests was 15 meters, 49 feet, off the ground and made of twigs and leaves. The white-necked mina, Streptocida albicolis, is a large, long-tailed species of starling in the family Sternidae. Due to its superficial resemblance to a magpie, it has been referred to as the Celebes magpie or Sulawesi magpie in the past. It is endemic to forests on Sulawesi and adjacent smaller islands in Indonesia. There are two subspecies, denominate from the southern part of Sulawesi has a yellow-tipped bill and toward water from the northern part of the island has an all-black bill. 
It grows to a length of between 23 and 26 centimeters, 9 and 10 inches. It eats berries and insects, and forages singly, as pairs or in small groups. The bear-eyed bina, Streptocida albertini, is a large, long-tailed species of starling in the family Sternidae. Its common name is a reference to the large patch of dark bare skin around the eyes. Due to its superficial resemblance to a magpie, it has been referred to as the slow magpie in the past. It is endemic to tropical open lowland forests on the Indonesian islands of Talabu and Mangal and the Sula Islands. It is threatened by habitat loss. It measures 29 to 32 centimeters, 11 to 13 inches, in length. Among standard measurements, the wing cord is 15.4 to 16.8 centimeters, 6.1 to 6.6 inches, the tail is 11.2 to 12.1 centimeters, 4.4 to 4.8 inches. The culmin is 2.9 to 3.3 centimeters, 1.1 to 1.3 inches, and the tarsus is 3.8 to 4.3 centimeters, 1.5 to 1.7 inches. It feeds mainly on fruits and berries. The fiery browed starling or fiery browed mina. An Odzerythrophrist is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is monotypic within the genus Anodes. Distinguished by a reddish orange stripe over the eye, it is endemic to the Indonesian island of Sulawesi, mainly living in humid highland forests. Coenrad Jacob Temin described this species by the name Lamprota ernest erythrophrys in 1824, and then moved it to the genus in Odes in 1839. It is monotypic within the genus in Odes, being the only species currently recognized. Joseph Harvey Riley described subspecies Centralis in 1920, comma, and Erwin Strassman described subspecies Lepterinchus in 1932. The Handbook of the Birds of the World lists these two subspecies as provisionally recognized because they may only be color variants. While the Ayat World Bird List does not recognize any subspecies. The fiery proud starling is 27 to 29 centimeters, 10.6 to 11.4 inches, long. The male and female are similar. The crown, back, throat, breast and belly are dark grey. A bright reddish orange supercilium starts from the base of the beak and extends over the eye, the feathers behind the eye being black. The flight feathers are brown, their outer webs and the wing covers covering them being olive yellow. The rump is golden, and the graduated tail is olive yellow, with a cream tip. The beak is black, and the legs are yellow. This species is endemic to the island of Sulawesi in Indonesia. It is found at elevations of 500 to 2,300 meters, 1,600 to 7,500 feet, living mainly in montane rainforest and also in lowland forest. Alphan forest and forest edges. This starling usually occurs in pairs or groups, and sometimes large flocks. It eats invertebrates and fruit, often climbing tree trunks to search for food. Mixed flocks with the Sulawesi mina and grosbeak starling, both also endemic to Sulawesi have been observed that fruit-bearing trees. Calls recorded include pape, 
tick tick and various guttural notes, and this song is a repeated metallic zeek zeek. The gross beak starling, Caesarostrum dubium, also known as the gross beak mina, finch billed mina, or scissor billed starling, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is monotypic in the genus Caesarostrum. It is endemic to Sulawesi, Indonesia. Its natural habitat is tropical lowland, and sometimes subtropical montane, lightly wooded forest areas and wetlands. This species nests in colonies, which frequently contain hundreds of pairs. Its nests are bored in rotting or dying tree trunks in woodpecker style. It eats fruit, insects, and grain. It grows to a length of 25 centimeters, mean 152 grams. Medium sized. Gross beak starlings are highly vocal, at their colonies and in feeding flocks. The gross beak starling was first described by the English ornithologist John Latham in 1801 under the binomial name Lanius dubium. The golden crested mina, Ampeliceps coronatus, is a species in the starling and mina family, Sternidae. It is found from northeastern India through Indochina and has been introduced to the British Indian Ocean Territory. Its main habitat is subtropical or tropical moist lowland forest, but it is also found in heavily degraded former forest. The Golden Crested Mina, Ampeliceps coronatus grows to a length of between 23 and 26 centimeters, 9 and 10 inches. It eats berries and insects, and forages singly, as pairs or in small groups. The common hill mina, Dracula religiosa, sometimes spelled mina and formerly simply known as hill mina or mina bird is the mina most commonly seen in viticulture, where it is often simply referred to by the latter two names. It is a member of the starling family, Sternidae, resident in hill regions of South Asia and Southeast Asia. The Sri Lanka hill mina, a former subspecies of G. religiosa, is now generally accepted as a separate species G. Telogenes. The Ngano hill mina, G. Nganensis, and Nias hill mina, G. Robusta, are also widely accepted as specifically distinct, and many authors favor treating the southern hill mina, G. Itica from the Nil Greece and elsewhere in the Western Ghats of India as a separate species. This is a stocky jet black mina, with bright orange-yellow patches of naked skin and fleshy wattles on the side of its head and nape. At about 29 cm length, it is somewhat larger than the common mina, Acridotherus tristis. It is overall green gloss black plumage, purple tinged on the head and neck. Its large, white wing patches are obvious in flight, but mostly covered when the bird is sitting. The bill and strong legs are bright yellow, and there are yellow wattles on the nape and under the eye. These differ conspicuously in shape from the naked eye patch of the common mina and bank mina. A. Gingenianus, and more subtly vary between the different hill minas from South Asia, in the common hill mina, they extend from the eye to the nape, where they join, while the Sri Lanka hill mina has a single wattle across the nape and extending a bit towards the eyes. In the southern hill mina, the wattles are separate and curved towards the top of the head. 
The NIAS and Ngano Hill Minas differ in details of the facial models, and size, particularly that of the bill. This mina is a resident breeder from Kuma on division in India, 80 degrees east longitude, east through Nepal, Sikkim, Bhutan and Arunachal Pradesh, the lower Himalayas, Terai and foothills up to 2000 meters ASL. Its range continues east through Southeast Asia northeastwards to southern China, and via Thailand southeastwards across northern Indonesia to Palawan in the Philippines. It is virtually extinct in Bangladesh due to habitat destruction and overexploitation for the pet trade. A feral population on Christmas Island has likewise disappeared. Introduced populations exist in St. Helena, Puerto Rico and perhaps in the mainland United States and possibly elsewhere. Feral birds require at least a warm subtropical climate to persist. The spina is almost entirely arboreal, moving in large, noisy groups of half a dozen or so, in treetops at the edge of the forest. It hops sideways along the branch, unlike the characteristic jaunty walk of other minas. Like most starlings, the hill mina is fairly omnivorous, eating fruit, nectar and insects. They build a nest in a hole in a tree. The usual clutch is two or three eggs. There is no sexual dimorphism in these birds which results in a limited possibility of choosing the sex to work with for mating. The hill minas are popular cage birds, renowned for their ability to imitate speech. The widely distributed common hill mina is the one most frequently seen in aviculture. Demand outstrips captive breeding capacity so they are rarely found in pet stores and usually purchased directly from breeders or importers who can certify the birds are traded legally. The Southern Hill Mina, Dracula Idica, is a member of the Starling family. It is a resident of Southwest India and Sri Lanka. This is a stocky jet black mina with bright orange-yellow patches of naked skin and fleshy waddles on the side of its head and nape, at about 29 centimeters length. The Sri Lanka hill mina, a former subspecies of G. religiosa, is now generally accepted as a separate species G. thelogenes. The Ngano hill mina, G. And Gainansis, and Nias Hill Mina, G. Robusta, are also widely accepted as specifically distinct, and many authors favor treating the Southern Hill Mina, G. Ibica, from the Nil Greece and elsewhere in the Western Ghats of India as a separate species. The Nias Hill Mina, or Nias Mina, Dracula Robusta, is a member of the starling family. It is an endemic resident of Nias and other nearby islands off western Sumatra. This large, stocky and superficially crow-like mina is the largest of the hill minas and may be the largest living species in starling family. It ranges from 30 to 36 centimeters. 12 to 14 inches, in total length. Among standard measurements, the wing cord is 20 to 21.3 centimeters, 7.9 to 8.4 inches, the tail is 9.9 .9 to 10.8 centimeters, 3.9 to 4.3 inches, 
The bill is 3.1 to 3.4 centimeters, 1.2 to 1.3 inches, and the tarsus is 4.4 to 5 centimeters, 1.7 to 2.0 inches. Body weight in the species has been reported as up to 400 grams 14 ounces. The Nias Hill Mino has mainly purple glossed black plumage. It has bright orange yellow patches of naked skin and large fleshy yellow wattles on the side of its head and nape. There are large white wing patches which are obvious in flight. The massive bill is mainly red, and the strong legs are bright yellow. The Smina is arboreal, and is found mainly in flocks and hill forests. Like most starlings, the Nias Mina is fairly omnivorous, eating fruit, nectar and insects. The Sri Lanka Hill Mina, Ceylon Mina, or Sri Lanka Mina, Dracula Tylogenes, is a Mina, a member of the starling family. This bird is endemic to Sri Lanka. This passerine is typically found in forest and cultivation. The Sri Lanka mina builds a nest in a hole. The normal clutch is two eggs. These 25 cm long birds have green gloss black plumage, purple tinged on the head and neck. There are large white wing patches which are obvious in flight. The strong legs are bright yellow, and there are yellow wattles on the nape. The different shape and position of the wattles and the stouter orange-red bill distinguish this species from the southern hill mina, which also occurs in Sri Lankan forests. The sexes are similar in plumage, but can be distinguished by iris color which is pale and females and dark in males. Juveniles have a duller bill and smaller wattles, and are less glossy overall. Like most starlings, the Sri Lanka mina is fairly omnivorous, eating fruit, nectar and insects. The Great Mina, also known as White Vented Mina, Acridotherus grandis, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is found in northeast India, through Bangladesh to southeast Asia. It is black with elongated forehead feathers forming frontal crest that may curl backwards. Its beak and feet are yellow. It has white from vent to tip of tail and a white wing patch. It will eat a variety of food including worms, grubs, grains, fruit, insects. The Crested Mina, Acridotherus cristatellus, also known as the Chinese starling, is a species of starling in the genus Acridotherus native to southeastern China and into China. It is named after the tuft of feathers on its forehead that resembles a crest. The crested mina is typically found in open spaces near urban and agricultural areas. They are a popular cage bird and, as a result, have been accidentally released in a few places outside of its usual range. For example, this species was introduced around 1890 into the Vancouver region of British Columbia. It was initially successful, reaching a population in the thousands, however, it has since then gone locally extinct in the area. Like many starlings, the crested mina is omnivorous. It will eat a variety of food including worms, grubs, grains, fruit, and even garbage. It is a highly beneficial bird to farmers as it feeds on insects and doesn't attack crops. The crested mina can be found in a wide range of habitats from urban to rural areas. 
in cities, it can be seen in the eaves of buildings, along roads and alleys, near gardens and parks, in parking lots. It can be found under bridges, in trees, in chimneys, and on roofs. In rural areas, it can be spotted on agricultural fields, in orchards and farmyards, near manure piles. It can be seen near plowed fields to take advantage of the invertebrates found in the tilled soil. It is often seen near cattle as it eats the insects around them. It is also commonly distributed in grasslands, fields and at the edge of forests. The first clutch of the season appears during the end of April or during May. Most pears are double brooded, which means they will have a second clutch in the same season. The second clutch appears in June to mid-August. The eggs are of a light blue-green color and have a similar shape of that of robin eggs. Typically, the clutch size is around 4 to 6 eggs. Every day, one egg is hatched. The hatchlings are born altricely. The eggs are incubated for 14 days, after which the fledglings move out of the nest onto a nearby tree or a shrub. The parents keep feeding them for about a week. The immature crested mynas do not separate from their parents. They typically form small family groups and form a larger flock with others for feeding and traveling. The Javan Mina, Acridotherus javanicus, also known as the white vented mina, is a species of mina. It is a member of the starling family. The Javan Mina is mainly black. The wings are brownish black, and the primaries have white bases. The undertail covers are white. There is a short crest on the forehead. The beak legs and feet are yellow. The eyes are lemon yellow. The immature is browner. Its length is 21 to 23 centimeters, 8.3 to 9.1 inches. Its weight is about 100 grams, 3.5 ounces. The Javan Mina is native to Java and Bali and has been introduced to Southeast Thailand, Southern Malaysia, Singapore, Sumatra, the Lesser Sundas, Taiwan. Puerto Rico, and Japan. It is found in cities and cultivated areas. The Javan Mina is omnivorous and eats seeds, fruit, nectar, insects, and human waste. It is often found in large groups. Its voice is similar to that of the common mina. It builds its nest in holes. The eggs are bluish glaucous. Javan manas are bold and not very afraid of humans. Javan manas are kept in cages in Malaysia and Indonesia. The birds scavenge in groups, minimum two but usually three or more, with all except one feeding and one usually at a vantage point keeping a look out. If the bird that is keeping watch sees anything that might pose a threat, it alarms the group members with a high-pitched tweet and they all flee the area swiftly. The pale-bellied mina, Acridotherus simius, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is endemic to the southwestern peninsula of Sulawesi, south from Rantipo, Indonesia. Introduced to Kaching, Sarawak, Borneo, and East Timor. It grows to a length of between 23 and 26 centimeters, 9 and 10 inches. It eats berries and insects, and forages singly, as pairs or in small groups. The jungle mina, Acridotherus fuscus, is a mina, a member of the starling family. 
It is found patchily distributed across much of the mainland of the Indian subcontinent but absent in the arid zones of India. It is easily recognized by the tuft of feathers on its forehead that form a frontal crest, a feature also found in the closely related Javan mina and the pale-bellied mina which were treated as a subspecies in the past. The eyes are paled, yellow or blue depending on the population and the base of the orange-yellow bill is dark. It has also been introduced either intentionally or accidentally into many other parts of the world including Fiji, Taiwan, the Andaman Islands, and parts of Japan. The species has also spread out on its own to some islands in the Pacific. Jungle manas are 23 cm long and have grey plumage, darker on the head and wings. The sexes are indistinguishable in plumage. A large white wing patches on the base of the primaries becomes conspicuous in flight, and the tail feathers are broadly tipped in white. There is a tuft of feathers on the forehead arising at the base of the bill. The bill and legs are bright yellow, and there is no bare skin around dias in the common mina and the bank mina. The base of the beak is dark in adults with a shade of blue at the base of the lower mandible. The southern Indian population has a blue iris. The northeast Indian populations have a smoky dark belly and bat. Juveniles are browner with a pale throat and along the median of the underside. Abnormal eucystic plumages have been recorded. The jungle mina is a common resident breeder in tropical southern Asia from Nepal, Bangladesh, India. Subspecies Fuscus is found across northern India west from Mount Abu, east to Pori and Orissa. It has also been introduced into the Andaman Islands in Fiji where it was introduced around 1890 to control insect pests and sugarcane. They have expanded on their own into some Pacific islands such as Neurfa where they are a threat to native bird species such as lorries, vini, with whom they compete especially for nest holes. In many parts of Asia, they are kept as pets and feral populations have established in many places such as in Taiwan. Breeding populations have established in Japan and Western Samoa. The population to work waters of Malaysia is on the decline and is possibly being outcompeted by Javan minas with which it form hybrids. This common passerine is typically found in forest and cultivation and often close to open water. They may disperse outside their range particularly after the breeding season. The breeding season is in summer and before the rains, February to May in southern India and April to July in northern India. They are secondary cavity nesters using both holes and trees in the man-made construction such as walls, embankments, and in houses from 2 to 6 meters above the ground. As secondary tree hole nesters, they compete with other hole nesters. They have also been recorded using the axils of fronds of palm trees in Malaysia. They sometimes use sloughed snake skins to line the inside of the nest hole. In the Himalayan foothills, they use dry pine needles to line the nest. The usual clutch consists of four to six turquoise blue eggs. Both sexes take part in nest building, incubation and feeding the young. They roost communally along with other minas, sometimes in sugarcane fields and reed beds. 
species of hemoproches are known from the blood of minus and they have also been found to host plasmodium circumflex some when artificially infected in the lab. Other parasites that have been found in the jungle mina include Dorisa ethiopsaris in the intestine. The colored mina, Acridotherus albosinctus, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. This common passerine is typically found in forest and cultivation and often close to open water. They may disperse outside their range particularly after the breeding season. It grows to a length of between 23 and 26 centimeters, 9 and 10 inches. It eats berries and insects, and forages singly, as pairs or in small groups. Bank Bina, Acridotherus chinchinianus, is a mina found in northern parts of South Asia. It is smaller but similar in coloration to the common mana but differs in having a brick red bare skin behind the eye in place of yellow. It is grayer on the underside and in this and in the presence of a slight tuft of feathers bears some resemblance to the jungle mina. They are found in flocks on the plains of northern and central India, often within towns and cities. Their range appears to be extending southwards in India. The name is derived from their habit of nesting almost exclusively in the earth and banks of rivers where they excavate holes and breed in large colonies. The head is black on the crown and sides and the upper plumage is slaty grey while the underside is lighter grey with pale pink plumage towards the centre of the abdomen. The wing is black but has a wing patch at the base of the primaries and the tips of the outer tail feathers are pale pinkish buff. The naked skin behind the eye is brick red, the legs are yellow while the iris is deep red. The sexes are indistinguishable and the field dot young birds have a browner head and neck. The species is evolutionarily closest to the common mina. The native range of the bank mina is almost restricted to the Indian subcontinent from the Indus Valley in the west, to the Gangetic Delta in the east and south of the lower foothills of the Himalayas, only rarely being found in sheltered valleys. They are found mainly in the vicinity of open water and their usual habitat is cultivated farmland and open country but flocks will often live within cities, in markets and railway stations. They make use of food scrap disposed by humans, even following catering vehicles at airports to standing aircraft. Bank minas have a nesting season from May April to July or August, most birds breeding in May and June. The nest is always built in earth walls, on the banks of rivers, embankments or the sides of open wells. They will sometimes make use of holes in brick walls. Nests have also been recorded between stacked bales of sugarcane stalks. They excavate the nest hole, the egg chamber sometimes 4 to 7 feet from the entrance. The nest is lined with grass, feathers and sometimes snake sloughs. About 4 of 5 pale sky blue or greenish blue eggs is the usual clutch. Two broods may be raised in the same season. The eggs hatch after about 13 to 14 days. Nestlings open their eyes after about 5 days and fledge in about 21 days. About 38% of the eggs hatched unto young that fledged in one study. A species of coccidian parasite, Isospa originginiana, and several species nematode, Oxyspirum, Chonotnia, 
Hymenopus sp, have been described from this species. The distribution was formerly noted to be restricted north roughly of a line between Bombay and Balasore in Orissa, but the species may be expanding its range. They are also common in Pakistan in the districts of Sindh and Punjab. A specimen from Kandahar was earlier considered the westernmost record of Agran, but the birds have since established in the region. Although mainly resident, they make movements in response to food and weather. The species name of the bird is based on the name given by Latham from a description by Pierre Sonnerat, who described Le Petit Martin de Ginny in 1782, referring to Ginji near Pondicherry in southern India. Thomas C. Jardin noted in 1860. That the species did not occur in southern India, however, the species was recorded in the region in 1914 at Bandar near Madras. Records from further south in India are, however, increasing. Breeding colonies have been found in Assam. These minas have been introduced into Kuwait, where they have established in the wild. Flocks have also been found in the Maldives, Taiwan and Japan. The common mina or Indian mina, Acridotherus tristis, sometimes spelled mina, is a member of the family Sternidae, starlings and minas, native to Asia. An omnivorous open woodland bird with a strong territorial instinct. The mina has adapted extremely well to urban environments. The range of the common mina is increasing at such a rapid rate that in 2000 the Aachen Species Survival Commission declared it one of the world's most invasive species and one of only three birds in the top 100 species that pose an impact to biodiversity agriculture and human interests. In particular, the species poses a serious threat to the ecosystems of Australia where it was named the most important best problem. It is a species of bird native to Asia with its initial home range spanning from Iran, Pakistan, India, Nepal, Bhutan, Bangladesh and Sri Lanka as well as Afghanistan, Uzbekistan, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan, Myanmar, to Malaysia, Singapore, Peninsular Thailand, Indochina, Japan, both mainland Japan and Ryukyu Islands, and China. The mina has been introduced in many other parts of the world such as Canada, Australia, Israel, New Zealand, New Caledonia, United States, South Africa, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan and Cayman Islands Islands in the Indian Ocean, Seychelles, Mauritius, Reunion, Madagascar, Maldives, Andaman and Nicobar Islands and Lakshadweep Archipelago, and also in islands of the Atlantic such as Ascension and St. Helena, and Pacific Oceans. The range of the common mina is increasing to the extent that in 2000 the Aachen Species Survival Commission declared it among the world's 100 worst invasive species. Common minas are believed to pair for life. They breed through much of the year depending on the location building their nest in a hole in a tree or wall. They breed from sea level to 3,000 meters in the Himalayas. The normal clutch size is 4 to 6 eggs. The average size of the egg is 30.8 by 21.99 millimeters. The incubation period is 17 to 18 days and fledging period is 22 to 24 days. The Asian colas sometimes brood parasitic on this species.
Nesting material used by manas include twigs, roots, toe and rubbish. Manas have been known to use tissue paper, tin foil and sloughed off snake skin. During the breeding season, the daytime activity time budget of common mana and pune in April to June 1978 has been recorded to comprise the following, nesting activity, 42%, scanning the environment, 28%, locomotion, 12%, feeding, 4%, vocalization, 7%, and preening related activities, interactions and other activities, 7%. The common mana uses the nests of woodpeckers, parakeets, etc. and easily takes to nest boxes, it has been recorded evicting the chicks of previously nesting pairs by holding them in the beak and later sometimes not even using the emptied nest boxes. This aggressive behavior contributes to its success as an invasive species. There is also some evidence that shows that in introduced environments, the species chooses to nest in more modified and artificial structures than in natural tree cavities when compared to native species. Like most starlings, the common mina is omnivorous. It feeds on insects, arachnids, crustaceans, reptiles, small mammals, seeds, grain and fruits and discard and waste from human habitation. It forages on the ground among grass for insects, and especially for grasshoppers, from which it gets the generic name Acrodothers, grasshopper hunter. It however feeds on a wide range of insects, mostly picked from the ground. It is a cross-pollinator of flowers such as Salmalia and Erythrina. It walks on the ground with occasional hops and is an opportunistic feeder on the insects disturbed by grazing cattle as well as fired grass fields. The Ballymina, Leucops for Rothschildi also known as Rothschild's Mina, Bali Starling, or Bali Mina, locally known as Gillette Bali, is a medium-sized, up to 25 cm, 9.8 inches, long, stocky Mina, almost wholly white with a long, drooping crest, and black tips on the wings and tail. The bird has blue bare skin around the eyes, grayish legs and a yellow bill. Both sexes are similar. It is critically endangered and fewer than 100 adults are assumed to currently exist in the wild. The Bali Mina is a medium-large bird around 25 cm 9.8 inches in length. It is almost wholly white with a long, drooping crest black wing tips and tail tip. It has a yellow bill with blue bare skin around the eyes and legs. The black wing starling, Sternus melanopterus, a similar species, has a shorter crest and a much larger area of black on wings and tail, plus a yellow wire ring, without feathers, and legs. The Bali Mina is restricted to the island of Bali, and its offshore islands, in Indonesia, where it is the island's only endemic vertebrate species. An endemic subspecies, the Bali tiger, has been extinct since 1937. The bird was discovered in 1910 and in 1991 was designated the final emblem of Bali. Featured on the Indonesian 200 rupiah coin, its local name is Jilak Bali. During the breeding season, the rainy season of Bali, males attract females by calling loudly and bobbing up and down. The birds nest in tree cavities, 
with the female laying and incubating two or three eggs. Both males and females bring food to the nest for chicks after hatching. In its natural habitat it is inconspicuous, using treetops for cover and unlike other starlings usually coming to the ground only to drink or to find nesting materials, this would seem to be an adaptation to its noticeability to predators when out in the open. The Bali mina often gathers in groups when it is young to better locate food and watch out for predators. The vocalizations are a variety of sharp chattering calls and an emphatic twat. The Bali mina's diet includes fruit, seeds, worms and insects. An breasted starling, Acridotherus bermanicus, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is sometimes placed in the mina genus Sternus. It is found in Cambodia, China, Laos, Malaysia, Burma, Thailand, and Vietnam. In the early 2000s, it has become an invasive species in Israel. Alongside the common manna that invaded a few years earlier. Both populations seem to have started from individuals that escaped the bird park in Tel Aviv. The Pied Mina or Asian Pied Starling, Gracupica contra, is a species of starling found in the Indian subcontinent and Southeast Asia. They are usually found in small groups mainly on the plains and low foothills. They are often seen within cities and villages although they are not as bold as the common mina. They produce a range of calls made up of liquid notes. Several slight plumage variations exist in the populations and about five subspecies are named. This mina is strikingly marked in black and white and has a yellowish bill with a reddish bill base. The bare skin around the eye is reddish. The upper body, throat and breast are black while the cheek, lores, wing covers and rump are contrastingly white. The sexes are similar in plumage but young birds have dark brown in place of black. The subspecies vary slightly in plumage, extent of streaking of the feathers and in measurements. The flight is slow and butterfly-like on round wings. Leucistic individuals have been recorded. The species is found mainly in the plains but in the foothills up to about 700 meters above sea level. They are found mainly in areas with access to open water. Their main distribution in India is from the Gangetic Plains extending south to the Krishna River. The range is increasing, with populations establishing more recently in Pakistan. Rajkut, and Bombay, since 1953, possibly aided by trade in caged birds and accidental escape. Their westward spread in India particularly in parts of Rajasthan has been aided by changes in irrigation and farming patterns, and the spread into Sumatra has been aided by deforestation. The species has also established itself in Dubai, Dewey. The habitat is lowland open areas with scattered trees near water, often near human habitation. This species is often seen at sewage farms and refuse tips. These starlings are usually found in small groups, foraging mainly on the ground but perching on trees and buildings. Birds in a group call frequently with a wide repertoire that includes whistles, trills, buzzes, clicks, and warbling calls. 
young birds taken into captivity have been trained to imitate tunes of other birds. Both sexes sing. They forage in fields, lawns and on open ground feeding on grains, fruit, insects, earthworms and mollusks usually taken from the ground. Like many other starlings, they often use a prying or gaping action, piercing soil and then opening apart the bill to dislodge hidden food. The strong protractor muscles allow them to part a mat of grass and their eyes are positioned to obtain a binocular view of the space between the parted beak. They often feed in grazing land or among cattle. The breeding season in India is spread from March to September. With the onset of breeding, the sizes of flocks decline and birds pair up. Courtship involves calling, fluffing of the feathers and head bobbing. The nest is a loose mass of straw formed into a dome with an entrance on the side and placed in a large tree, often banyan, mango, jackfruit, rosewood, or sometimes on man-made structures, often close to human habitation. Several pairs will breed in the same vicinity. The usual clutch is made up of about four to six glossy blue eggs. Each egg is laid with a day in between and incubation begins only after the third or fourth egg is laid. The eggs hatch after 14 to 15 days. The young are brooded for two weeks, the female staying at the nest during the night. Both parents feed the chicks until they fledge and leave after three weeks. More than one brood may be raised in a season. An instance of interspecific feeding, where an adult of a common mina fed a young pied mino has been reported. These minas form communal roosts at night and jointly defend nesting areas. The black-winged starling, Acridotherus melanopterus, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. The species is also known as the black-winged mino or the white-breasted starling. It is endemic to Indonesia. There are three recognized subspecies, the Namanae trace, which occurs across much of the island of Java, tricolor which is restricted to southeast Java, and Tertius, which is found on Bali and possibly Lombok. The validity of the records on Lombok has been called into question, as there were only a few records and those may represent escapees from the caged bird trade or natural vagrants. The species has often been assigned to the starling genus Sternus, but is now placed in Acridotherus because it is behaviorally and vocally closer to the birds in that genus. The black-winged starling is a small starling, 23 cm 9.1 inches, in length. The plumage of the species is striking, with the head, breast, back and rump being white, and the tail and parts of the wings glossy black. The tip of the tail and parts of the wings are also white. The skin around the eye is unfeathered and yellow. The bill is yellow, and slightly darker towards the base. The sexes are alike and young birds are like the adults except that juveniles crown and back are grey. The subspecies tricolor is similar to the nominate but has a grey back and much more black on the wings. The subspecies tertius is similar to tricolor except the grey on the back descends to the tail. Its natural habitats are tropical dry forests, tropical dry shrubland, tropical moist shrubland, and pasture land, from sea level up to 2,400 meters. 
Until recently it had adjusted to human modified habitats well, moving into orchards, lawns, suburban areas and other cultivated land. The black-winged starling feeds on a variety of items, including fruit, nectar and insects. It feeds in small groups and in pairs, both in trees and on the ground. It roosts communally at night in groups, sometimes with other starling species like the Bali starling. It is a seasonal breeder, although the exact timing of the breeding season varies by location. Birds in West Java breed from March to May, but in East Bali the season is around June. They are apparently monogamous, nesting in a twig-lined hole amongst rocks or in a tree. The red-billed starling, Spodiopes reseraisus, is a species of starling in the family Sternidae. It is found in south and southeastern China. The white-cheeked starling or grey starling, Spodiopes reseraisus, is a passerine bird of the starling family. It is native to Eastern Asia where it is a common and well-known bird in much of its range. Usually, it is placed in the genus Spodiopes. White-cheeked starlings are 24 cm in length. The adult male is mainly dark grey-brown with a paler belly and a whitish band across the rump. The head is blackish with whitish cheeks and forehead. There is a white border to the tail and white markings on the secondary wing feathers. The legs are pale orange and the bill is orange with the black tip. Adult females are similar to the males but paler and duller. The juvenile is brown with pale cheeks and rump and no black tip to the bill. The loud, monotonous call is a series of harsh, creaking notes. The breeding range covers central and northeast China, Korea, Japan and southeast Siberia. In winter birds from colder regions migrate south to southern and eastern China, South Korea, southern Japan, Taiwan and northern Vietnam with vagrants reaching the Philippines, Thailand and Myanmar. There is a record from Homer. Alaska in 1998 which probably arrived with a ship, West 2002. It inhabits woodland, farmland, and open country and has also adapted to parks and gardens in urban areas. It is most common in lowland areas, usually below 700 meters in Japan. It has a varied diet which includes fruit and insects such as mole crickets. The breeding season lasts from March to July and often two clutches of eggs are laid during that time. The nest is built in a hole in a tree or building or in a nest box. Four to nine eggs are laid and are incubated for 14 to 15 days. The young birds fledge 13 to 15 days after hatching. 